Welcome to the Burlington High School 2022 alumni game for hockey. I'm Evan McNamee alongside Robert Paris on camera. We are just about underway. White is the away team for Burlington and red is the home team for Burlington here at the Burlington Ice Palace. Zero to zero as we're just about to get underway. Game's going to begin soon. The throwing the puck or dropping the puck, I don't know what it's called. Game two. We'll begin soon for game two, the alumni games. While we have time, I'll begin reading the rosters. Dennis Mahoney, class of 1994. Sean McDonald, class of 1995. Matt Gordon, class of 1995. Tim Mulchie, or Mulcahy, class of 1998. Jimmy Martin, class of 1998. Chris Doyle, class of 2002. Rich, Rich Barnard, class of 2003. Bobby Concession, class of 2003. Donald Morgan, class of 2003. Sean Power, class of 2007. Paul Concession, class of 2009. Dan Hannafin, class of 2010. Neil Pandolfio, class of 2010. And because the game has started, I will continue reading the names later. Number 71 has it for white. Number six hits it midair, bringing it back. 30 will take it for red. 71 getting it. There's a 360 there. Goes around the goal. Pass it to number two who misses it and it goes to number 43 who will then pass it. 30 still takes it and gets stolen by 71. 71 will pass it to a no-numbered person. Will then go to 21. Will then pass it again. I don't know what number that is. I think it's like 25. Hits the wall and no number and the no-numbered will have it. It gets stolen. Stolen by number 76. And that's it. One nothing. One nothing for guest, I think. There is someone in the scoreboard box. And they're not updating it. So it's one nothing. Home, I think. Yeah, one nothing. One nothing home. One nothing home. They're not updating the scoreboard again. That's hit, gets right by. 71 and the no numbered are in a rundown. Gets hit again. 31 will take it. Gets stolen by 44. On his way back up. Right side of the ice. 71 will take it. And it's a miss by 76. And the ball, and the, the puck, sorry, will now go to number three, 31 actually. Slides against the wall. Number 29, 44, we're in a fight for it, but it is taken. 76 now with it. Hill. Save. It's a save. One nothing. One nothing, I think, guessed. Yes, one nothing guessed. Oh no, one nothing home. Let's pass to number 71. On the ice, retreating towards the middle. Has to pass it, gets to number 11. Oh, he sm sprays some snow, and that goes on. Going around, pass to number two. He'll pass it again. Number five and 29 trying to get it. 20, oh no, not 29. Oh, it's stolen again by number 71. And that's hit. 
Nope, no goal, and 11 will hit it. No goal. Oh, I don't know, I lost the puck. Oh, there it is, number 11 has it. On his way. It's a goal, 71 with it now. Six. He'll pass it again. It's grabbed by 71. 26 with it, no, 29 with it now. He'll pass it. Hits it. Hits the wall. 20, no, 71 gets it. Hits it downfield to 11. And 11 is going to get it in for the goal. 1-1 one, one tie. This ball, or this hockey game is now tied with a 1-1 one, one score. Scoreboard has not updated though. I am Evan McNamee alongside Robert Paris at camera. Score 1-1 one, one in the Burlington Hockey. 2022 alumni game, game two. It's in the puck off. Number two has it, he'll pass it. Bunch of stick slaps here. The no numbered white person hits it. Red will, the red person will take it. It's taken again. No number and is taking it again. Passes it to number 31. 76 will take it. It's hit. 44 with it. I'll pass it again. And that is in. Was that in? Yeah, that was in. It is two to one. Two to one red, which is the home team in this game. Lots of action here in the first seven minutes. Just about to drop the puck. Drops it. 31 with it. It's hit. They're wrapping it around. It is taken by 13. Who will give it to the no numbered person? 13 will grab it. It is around. I don't know who has it. I can't see it from here. Oh, it's the no-numbered person. He'll pass it to 11, no, 13. Who will hit it and it's blocked by the goalie. No goal. Wait, no, it's two to two. Goes to the middle, I think it goes in. Oh yeah, it, it was not in. It is 2-2-1. It's 2-1. Two to one. Number 2 with it, two with it now. 43. Racing up field. 20. 39 gets it. 50-71. 29 now. Hits it. Block. 29 will take it for White. No, 28, sorry. Ben, it's it. Was that in? Save. Save. Oh, here we go. Oh, the scoreboard's working now. It's two to one. Two to one guess. So I think the guest may be red and the home may be white. I'll have to check when the next score hits. Currently in another draw. Pass 71, missed, and that is in. That is in there, I think. No, it's not in. And we'll take it, passes it to number two. Right by Wild Puck. 71 will take it. Goes around the net. Is it 70 now is taking it? 
follow up. It's taken by Red. Going downfield, past the 71. Missed. White now has it. Number 71, White has it. Red has it. It is passed. And that is in. Score. Another score. The score is. Someone's working the scoreboard. I think it's three to two. If I'm not mistaken, it is three to two. Or three to one, sorry. I believe it is three to one. The no numbered person will take it. They'll get hit. Two no has it. Missed, no goal. Hit around picked up by the no number. The nine with it. Hits it safe. I think that made it, was that a save or was that a goal? That was a save. and now spray some snow. Six has it. No num the no number hits it upfield. Eleven's got it. Eleven keeps having it. Headed up to 71. Who shoots it? No goal. 29 now. Nope. 71 for White. Lock. 31. Hits. Tries to do like a little golf move. No goal. Save. 71. 71 has been in pretty act, pretty much action recently. Fight over here. 71 once again will have it. Is that in? Don't know. That was in. It is three to two, I think. Three to two. Someone's gonna have to keep that down. Oh yep, three to two. Red is guest. White is home. I just had to reassure that because last game in alumni game one it was switched. Speaking of Alumni Game 1, time to re review what Alumni Game 1 was. It was essentially the people from the 90s through 70s playing hockey again. And that, speaking of, that is in for a goal. So it is now 3-3. Three, three. It should be 3-3. Three, three. And for our crew today in Alumni Hockey Game 2 for 2022, I'm Evan McAmey alongside cameraman Robert Paris. The score is 3-3, three to three, or it should be. Hit 2-21, he'll hit it. Round new D. Let's hit again. Going to fight for it. 13 now taking it. Put it around. It's taken by number 21. Anyone fighting for it? They'll go around. That's hit. 11 for White will now take it. It's the back of 
tie game. It's the back of 29. and it hits the wall. Up the field, number 30 has it. Hits it to 21, 21 misses. Number nine hits it back up field. 29 now has it for White. He'll shoot it to 28. When he gets it stolen from him by 71, I think. No, 76. Currently, Puck is in number... 76 hands, back to 21, hit blocked. Now that I think they're in a little break, I'll continue reading off the names. Paul Concession, 2009. Dan Hannafin, 2010. Oh, sorry. Paul Concession, 2009. Dan Hannafin, 2010. Neil Pandolfo, 2010. Peter Milnazzo, 2010. And I'll finish the names later because they are playing again. 71 has it for red. It's hit up, goalie blocks it. Fight with it. Hit up to 71. He'll hit it. 13 takes it for white. Number 20. Six, no, 28 now has it. Goes down to the other side of the field. We have 14 minutes remaining here in half number one. <laughs> 71 going down the court. Gets it around. It's blocked by the other 71. We get hit to 29. 29 hits it off the wall. Loud bang there. Bang, bang, bang. 29 like running on the ice, like literally running to get the puck. And he'll hit it. That is no goal. Puck is blown dead by the official. As it is 3-3, three to three, tie game. There is a goalie switch happening right now. So they're about to drop the puck on the left side of the rink. not in. 71 takes it upfield. Hit to 21. 71 takes it. Spray some snow. Hits it. And gets stolen by 11. Do the other 71 now. Gets past number 21. Number 21 is going downfield past the halfway point in opponent territory. 44 gets it, it's it, to 71 I think, 71 I believe. The 76 that was, let's hit back up. 71 hits it, gets hit down. 71 shoots back again, misses again. 76 now with it, he'll hit it. It's taken by 11. Ooh! That had to hurt. 71 just got slammed against the wall. That couldn't have been good. Diving for the block. 13 now has it. A little no number has it. Now to 76. He will... Hit that down to, oh, stolen. 13 has it now. 
29 hits it back up. Hit by 30 to 22. The no, 28, sorry, my bad. You know, this may be a coincidence, but I think I just saw my sister's fifth grade teacher. Which is a bit odd. Okay, back to the game. I don't know what's going on because I don't know where the puck is. Ten minutes left in the first half. I'm Evan McNamee alongside Robert Paris in the Burlington High School 2022 alumni game. Okay, back on the game. It's in number 28. It'll go around the wall, taken by the goalie. No, never mind. It's taken by number... Number, I can't see the number. Number six has it. They'll hit it up. Number 29 gets it. Misses. It's kicked. 29 for White has it. It's a little duster gets hit. 29 will grab it. That'll be hit. No goal. It's hit back up the field. It's blocked. 43 midfield. It's about to hit it, or sorry, mid rink. It's gonna hit it. It's back up to number, it was hit to number 29, but it got returned back. It's number six, I think that is. Have it. 29 for the white team now has it. Up field. No goal, no goal. Eight and a half minutes remaining. Three to three still. 76 up there. Runs into the goalie. That'll be missed on the side. It was picked up by 29. 29 racing for it. 44 now in reverse. He'll take it. It's taken again by 11. Marching down field. 71 now with it. That's hit to, I don't know, I couldn't see the number. 11 has it, no, 71 has it. Passes it to 76, he will pass it to 21. 21 will pass it, no goal, he'll get it again, 21 with it. Pass around, number two and, 70, and 21, sorry, in a fight for it, 21 gets it. It is stolen. 21 brings it back in from the yeah, from the white. It is hit. Caught. That's a save if I've ever seen one. Whistle blown once again. Still waiting. Three three tie. There it is, the draw. It's hit to number 30. That's missed. Oh, 76 and 11 racing for it. 76 will get it. Fighting down on the other side of the field. I don't know who has it, if it's 11 or 21. Oh, none of them now. Because now 71 has it. Oh, the other 71 to 71 has it from 29. On his knees, sliding for that. The no numbered player now is up. Number two takes it. Hit up field. 
71 with it now. Never mind, number two takes it. We'll go around the goal. He's in a trap. He's in a pickle. The no numbered player will take it. Goes around. We'll hit it. Going around. Speeding past everyone else. He'll pass it to 31. 31 will shoot. No goal. It's a block. Number two will miss. And it is stolen. 29 with it now. It is passed on to number six. Six will pass it. It's hit really high, and that's a loud knock. Sit up. It's knocked up. 28 running for it. Goalie's also running for it. The goalie will get it. 28 now with it. No goal. 71 blocks it because the goalie was going for the save. Whistle is blown. Four minutes and 45 seconds remaining. Puck is hit down to the official calling the game. Four and a half minutes left. I'm Evan McNamee alongside Robert Paris in the 2022 Burlington High School Hockey Alumni Game, game two. Getting hit. hit. 21 with it. Fighting through. Oh, he'll keep it to himself. Hits it, blocked. 44 now. It's blocked again. Right in the chest. That gotta hurt. 21 keeps getting it. He's gonna hit it. It's taken by number 13. Number 31 with it now. Get it, fighting 29 with 71. It's going around, pass to 13. He'll pass to 20, 28. 28 will hit it and it'll miss, no goal. It's hit, three and a half minutes remaining. 13 takes it, but it'll pass it to 44 on accident. It's hit by 76, popped up, no goal. Hit around, 29 now has it. <laughs> the guy just belly slid on the ice. That ought to be fun if you weren't in a hockey game, however. Going around is number 30. 13 now with it, hits it to the other side. 29. Did it, blocked, or not blocked. Missed the goal, went around it. Now number 29 with it. Pass to number six, missed. 30 with it, hits it. No, that was 39, sorry. He's gonna hit it. It's taken by 71. It's stolen again by six. And six will almost get it in. That was very, very loud. Anyways, number 29 has it. I'll pass it to the no-numbered player. It is saved, I think. Wait, no, was that in? I don't know, was that in? We'll see if it was in in a minute. It was in. Yes. It was in, they're going to the middle. That means it's a goal, four to three. Four to three, home. Hit now. 71 with it. Ooh! He fell on the guy. That ought to be painful. Let's pass. Pass around and clump. Number two's got it. He'll hit it up. Number, tw number 11 with it now. No numbered player has got it. Hits it around to number nine fighting for it. It'll be grabbed, locked. 11, 
around 71 to block it. 71 got it. Passes it to 30. He'll hit it to 21. And 21 will get it stolen by 71, who will go to the no-numbered player. 11's going to get it. And he'll shoot it in and miss. Number nine now. A lot of pressure being applied. Robert, what are your thoughts on this game so far? Very fast pace. Well, it's hockey, so <laughs> I suppose that's expected. I'd assume so. Hockey's a fast place game. Was that it or was that a miss? 20 seconds remaining in this game. At the end of the half, the score is four to three. I am Evan McNamee alongside Robert Paris, and we will see you in the second half. Goodbye. I am Evan McNamee alongside Robert Paris, and they're about to begin. Hit. 31 now will take it. Get it back. I get hit up 11 with it. He'll go around downfield. Pass it. The whistle is blown. Was that a goal or was that not a goal? I don't know. No. It was no goal. It's a save. 23 minutes left and a half. There was only 25 minutes for the half compared to last half's 30. Let's hit again. It's passed up. Oh, 76 and 13 fighting for it. Hits the wall. 11 gets it. 11 gets it. He'll pass it up to 28. For a second, I thought 28 only had half a hockey stick, but that was just the angle. Number nine goes around, he'll miss it. He'll give it to number 71, I think. Yes, 71. Ooh! He just went sliding across the ice. Once again, I made this joke last game. It's like a water slide in the middle of winter. Water slide season is coming. Sir so Robert, are you going to head to a water park this summer? Ah, uh, I got a goal! Right as I'm saying that. <laughs> because I Gets it. It'll be hit to 29. 44 now. Missed. I am Evan McNamee alongside Robert Harris with 21 minutes remaining. It'll be hit. Oh, that's in. I'm pretty sure that is an in goal. You are correct. It was a goal. Big day of hockey for the alumni games. Two games in a row. Some might say a double header. But what I call it is the double alumni because here it's the alumni games. Speaking of, this is game two of the alumni game series. About to have a drop off. 
gonna hit it down. Gets hit. Pass to number seven. Let it bounces off the glass. Good thing that glass is there. Otherwise, it probably would have gotten nailed in the face at least once. Passed up number 44 with it now. That'll be passed up again. 30, who will oh, hit it in? One of the players isn't wearing a glove. We have 17 minutes and 50 seconds left. I'm Evan McNamee alongside Robert Paris. The other camera that you probably are gonna see in post-production, no one is screwing that, it's a stationary. This is game two of the alumni hockey for Burlington High School 2022. 44 with it, it gets stolen by 13. Go downfield, he'll shoot and miss. In a fight now, there's a fight by the wall. It's hit. 44 now with it, it'll be past to 71. Hits it to 21. It'll, hit, it'll get it stolen, no, never mind. We'll still have it, but it was stolen. 44 gets it, 21 now with it. He'll get it, he'll shoot and miss.
Scoreboard has not been updated, so we have to keep track in our heads. 71 steals it. No, 76. He'll get, the hood it gets caught in the glove by the goalie. Why does that glove look so much like a baseball glove? I feel like I'm watching cold baseball, not hockey. You know, I feel like hockey's sort of a football slash soccer combination. It's got the gear of football, but sort of the playing style of soccer. And you know what, Robert? What are your thoughts on the game so far, now that we're in the home stretch? Um, a lot of young guys here coming out for the alumni game. They're obviously back to be excited to be back on the ice. I know they, they this is a sport they love, they grew up with, they were on the Burlington High School team. This is great to see them playing the game they love. I'm pretty sure there was just a goal, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, there was a goal. it was that loud. Like we're like a good 30 feet, like 100 feet away probably. Actually closer to 50. And we can hear that loud. We have the action right in front of us right here. It's hit 29, gets it. But it's 71. He'll hit it to 29. Run up, still hits it, 29, misses it. No goal, 71 now running down. It is caught by, or not caught, pass to number three, missed. Pass, 71, no, 21 with it. Gives it to 71. Oh, 71 falls with the puck. That gives it to number nine right there. He'll hit it across. Almost hits the guy trying to get on the bench. Ooh, that would not have been fun if it hit him. It's passing the fight with it. Oh, the no number jersey's back on the field. Or ring. 21 with it. He'll give it. No, he won't give it to anyone. It gets stolen. Oh, 29 gets it back. Goes up field, gets taken by 71. We'll hit that to the no-numbered player, who will pass it to 28. That'll be hit. You know, it's been a long time since I've done a hockey game. So the fact that I'm here, it's a bit odd for me since I'm used to baseball, considering the baseball season's literally right here. 21 with the puck. We'll hit it in. That is it. Right above the goalie's shoulder. What a shot. Like, sheesh. You don't see shots that good every day. Oh, I think someone's updating the scoreboard. Six with it. Pass it up. Hit to 13. He'll give it to 21. He'll give it to 30. 13 will take it. He'll let it to 28. 28 with the puck. He'll hit it to 13. He'll almost get it in. 
10 minutes remaining here in this alumni game. Alumni game two to be specific. It is past. Number 13 with it, he'll pass it. It's hit, gets stolen. I'm Evan McNamee alongside Robert Paris in the Alumni Games 2022 Burlington Hockey. There's no way that didn't go in. That hadn't gone in. Yep, it did. Yep. 71 now gets it. The no numbered person will now hit it. Better across. No goal! So white is home, red is away. Gets hit again, on a line, hit it back, number two. Get it at 39, almost had it, but it gets stolen by the no-numbered player. And that, that's it. I'm like, there is, I was like, there is no way that's not it. So that makes it. You know, there have been hockey games, and then there have been the alumni games. Hits the wall, 71 going around, gives it to six. Let it, oh, it gets stolen by nine on the, on the pass to 71. 11 will take it now. Hits it to 31. 31 will hit it. Almost in, but it's blocked just before. What a close one there, that is. Slid. That's in! He was just breaking the goalie's ankles there. Or breaking his own. And then he capitalized because the goalie wasn't knowing where he was gonna shoot it. So he's like, I'm gonna shoot this in, but am I gonna shoot it here or there? Or there or there? Or here or there? And the goalie's like, um, just shoot it. He's I'm gonna like, die. He goes, okay, and he scored. He'll get it. It'll be hit to number. Seventy-one now has it. We hit that. Eleven nine with just six minutes on the clock. I'll hit off. Seventy-one gets it. Thirty now. Seventy-six. He'll give it. Nine with it. Gets taken by seventy-one on his on his team though. And here gives it to number six. All right, number two now with it. We'll give it to 71, who will lock it. No goal. Wait, no, was there a goal? It's a goal. That was a goal.
That is the correct score. That gets hit. 13 with it. Look, that hits the glass. Lucky a puck didn't like finger through. That'll get hit. Goes to 28, he'll miss it. Gets hit. Hit. Goes on the line. 71 going up the middle. A little closer, sprays some snow. He'll hit it. Hits the goalie. I think that may have been near his face mask. Number 11, speeding downfield, passes it to 28. He'll hit it. No goal. It's a goal. Oh, it was a goal. That makes No, 43, I think. I can't tell because of the jersey being talked. Pretty sure that's 43, though. It's right by everybody. 43 on a run towards it. The goalie misses it. That was almost a free goal if the goalie hadn't gotten back in time. That could have been really bad. Wide open goal. That is in. Still with it, trying to make a last ditch effort. I think it's safe to say it's game. Four, three, two, one, and that is the 
game. This is Evan McNamee and Robert Paris. But before we sign off, I said I have to read the roster names, so I will continue from where I left off. Mike Fahey, 2010. Joe Yeadon, 2011. Sean Murphy, 2013. Tom Serbian, 2015. Shane O'Halloran, 2016. Anthony Nicolupis, 2016. Joe Bertolami, 2017. Frank Bonanno, 2018. Sean, Sean Sera Seraven, 20, 2018. Never mind, they're starting a new game. I will, can, I will finish the name since I got one name left. Connor Quinlan, 2019. And that is the roster for the alumni hockey game. And now, I wonder what's going on here. Are they playing another game? Bonus round. Oh, bonus round, yeah, that must be. I'll hit it, 29, got it. Oof, loud bang. I hear loud bang arenas a lot. I mean, if you were here during the practice, which you probably weren't, you would hear like bang, bang, bang. It was loud. 44 now with it. Let me hit in, block. That's it. Can you hit it. 29 with it. Goes up, goes around. Don't hit it. it. Goes around, almost in again. Thought it was in again. <laughs> 71 with it. Hits it. No, he doesn't hit it. Now he hits it, and that's a wild puck. It's taken by 30, immediately stolen by 11. And 11 just drops the puck and giving it to 21. 21 now. We'll hit that, 21 again. And that is it! That is in one nothing red. Yes. Guest, the guest is ahead by one in the alumni hockey game bonus round, I'm gonna call this, with eight minutes left on the clock. Going in the center now. And hit, 31 with it. Does a spin move and he falls. Wonder how long it's been since these guys have skated. Some of these guys, it's been like three years probably. Others, it's been a bit. No one from the classes of 2020, or no one from the class of 2020. There were actually some people that worked at BCAT that graduated in the class of 2020, I'm pretty sure. And if you've watched something to talk about, you probably know who they are. Hmm. I'm not trying to do an in, in promotion for something else. Because it's definitely not my mom's show. But anyways, back to the game. Gets hit. On a line, number 39 with it. Hit again, number nine. Ooh, 39 fell. 71 racing for it, he'll get it. Hits it hard. No number got it. Ooh, that's in. One, one tie game. One to one tie game. You know, this game is closer than the last with six minutes remaining. I am Evan McNamee alongside Robert Paris in the alumni hockey bonus round, which I'm going to call it. I'm not sure what it's actually called, probably overtime. But we're just gonna see this. Let's hit 76 with it, too high. 
Gets hit, 71. Someone hits that pass, number two. Gets to 71, he'll hit that, he'll hit it up. Number nine now, passes it to number two, who gets a pass to the no number, who gives it off to 11 by just letting go, and gets stolen by number 44, who passes it, gets it taken away by number nine. Goes way down, number 11 hits it, too high and another bang. Gets hit, 44 with it, gives it to 21. Gets hit, a little wobbly there, I think someone blocked it. Gets over to 43, 43 will hit it. No goal, no goal again. What a save. Oh, two what saves by the goalie. Four and a half minutes remaining in this bonus time period. Hits it against the wall. It's passed you by 11. It'll go to 13 now. He'll give it 13 with it. No, 31 with it. Hit it again. 38 with it. He'll hit it. So Robert, you've been doing the sports business for a while. What is your most memorable overtime experience that you've ever seen? Are we talking about hockey? Are we talking about any sport? Any sport and any league. I probably would say the most, probably the best overtime I've experienced actually happened this uh, a couple weeks ago. It was girls lacrosse. They played a really good Lexington team and they won in like nine seconds left. They won with nine seconds left in overtime. No, they won, they won with the, so overtime started, they won and it only took nine seconds. And that, wow. was, that was really, that was a really good game. An overtime that's probably familiar for any of you football fans is Super Bowl 51's overtime. Yes. That was an iconic one. Falcons fans got their hearts broken. Patriots fans added another ring to their f hand. <laughs> But Patriots fans still have four fingers that are just so sad and lonely. And Patriots fans complain about that. Yet they haven't even seen the Lions who don't even have a championship banner for their conference. Okay, back to the game anyways. 29 gives it to number 31. It's on the wall, the goalie hits it now. Goalie gets pinned on the wall. It'll be hit blocked. Blocking him pretty well. Gets under it. Gets it almost in. The goalie's leg was in the way though, getting it the block. Gets passed on to 28. 28 will hit it. Going in, going in. Gets it away to number nine. Number nine spin moves. Gets away, gets it stolen. And then hit to the ground. Number nine with it. For a second I thought that was going in the stand. Number two now, gives it, gets caught by number nine. This isn't baseball, this is hockey. Stop catching everything. Hit on the line. One and a half minutes left. Hopefully they don't go into overtime. Because I think this already is overtime. Bonus round. Yes. This is the bonus round. I think they're just going to play more hockey. No, they weren't, they weren't, they weren't tied. They were, I think this is just playing for until the time. Technically, it would expire, which is like the game started at 540, so. The clock stopped. It stopped because they're not playing right now. They have to do the thing right there. Gets hit. 71 hits it. Gives it to nine. 
That'll get stolen. It'll be thrown over, hit. 76 gets it though. No recover. Hits it on a, hits it away on the line. That gets hit, and that is in. 45 seconds remaining, and it is two to one. Yes. Two to one. Yes. Yes. Forgot to say that. Gets hit. Someone lost their stick. They lost their stick and that's in, three to one. Where was the goalie? They added an extra defender. Oh, so they added an extra defender, but they removed the goalie. It's three to one. Yes, it is three to one. And with eight seconds remaining, I can safely say they're taking the nets off. Zamboni's probably gonna come around. And that is game. That's the alumni hockey games, folks. This is Evan McNamee alongside Robert Paris signing off.